Photo suck. Shoulders in, use the light. Posture. My right side, that's my good side. Smile, no smile. Smile, smile. Are we smiling? Am I the only one who always ends up with red eye? Don't make me fight you. You don't want to see what I really am. Same. Doom Patrol. All these characters we're introducing, we get to be the first ones to present the live action versions of these characters. It's awesome. Sounds like everyone's having fun. Doom Patrol is introduced in Titans because Beast Boy has introduced Raven into the Doom Patrol family. And we're like a safe haven for Raven to come into. Who lives here? That is a complicated answer. Gar brings her back to his home, which is kind of like this strange Adams family setup. Who's this? It's Rachel. I was just showing her out. Even though the Doom Patrol are tragic and dark and strange, there is a whimsical nature to them. And Gar, I think, embodies that perfectly. He's like the Eddie Munster of the group. That's an original. 1948, you ever see it? Aren't you a little young to be watching something so old? You mean classic. Rita Farr, she's kind of the mother of the Doom Patrol. She becomes like protoplasm and she can't contain herself and she like scares people because she's just a mess. I'm not scared of you. We have Robot Man, who's like the father kind of figure, Frankenstein-ish. Gotcha! We have Negative Man, who's kind of like the fun uncle. And also the godfather, which is the chief. Who's the chief? Oh, huh, what is that? Greatest doctor in the world. Saved all of us. You have Gar kind of being pulled away from the Doom Patrol family and into this new team. Go. Go with them. Go have a life. The characters in the Doom Patrol contrast the Titans' heroes. We're more of the misfits. We weren't born with these powers. We were just normal human beings, like, enjoying our life, and then terrible things happen to us. And now we're kind of freaks of nature. Let her go. I need it. Rachel.